boating and just barely sneaking through, you, you cricket talk gang had me scared for a little bit there. But Giratina just barely pulled through. So we are going to go ahead and start with Giratina as our starter. I'm going to nickname it after Darkstone, one of our subscribers. He also voted, so thank you very much. Super appreciate it. And actually, this can tie into today's uh, question of the day. Uh, what's, uh, yeah, Darkstone. Who is your favorite of the creation trio being Giratina, uh, Palkia, and Dialga? If I had to pick personally, it's probably Dialga. I just have a personal preference. I also played Diamond as my first uh, of the Gen 4 games, so I'm a little biased in that regard. Hey, we just got this nice old man's phone number. We're making moves, making moves. I absolutely adore this Chris sprite for the that they made for this game. I think this heals us. Okay, yeah, so it does heal us sweets. Uh, I should also go back. Oh, also, since it's a hardcore Nuzlocke, we're not... What do you give us? Ah, oh, worthless. Perfect. Can't use those. Yes, that, that ties in perfectly to what I was going to say. So we can't use potions during battle. Um, yeah, that's just potions or any healing items except held like berries and stuff. So we may end up trying to get, uh, once we get berries... We don't battle here, do Oh, I need to check out uh, Darkstone. That is my bad. But we are an assistant now. And there's some creepy guy just staring in the window. I wonder what that's about. Anyway, let's check out our new uh, compatriot here. It has an item. Oh, it starts with an Orenberry. It lacks nature. That's not terrible. Um. Oh, contrary. Reverses. Oh! Surge Strikes? Is that... Oh my god, are, are moves randomized too? Uh, and heal pulse? That kind of sucks. Wait, I didn't think the moves were randomized too. I thought it was just... Okay, so this is like a hardcore randomizer. Oh, that's scary. Contrary is really good though. So like if, like for instance, if they growl us... Ooh, and our special defense... All our defensive stats are S rank... The rest of it kind of sucks. Our attack's pretty mediocre, but our defenses aren't terrible. Giratina's really bulky. And E minus. Oh, so, oh, another thing, too. It actually shows if we have, like, perfect IVs. Since it's because we're a, a legendary, probably. It could have just been luck, but we got three perfect IVs because we're a legendary. That's really cool. So, um, I don't know if I said it. Contrary, what it does. So, like, let's say we get growled. We'll actually gain attack instead of losing attack. Hey, man, do you need help? What are you staring at? Oh, that was rude. Anything hidden back here? I don't think so. I think our mom actually gives us money in this too. Maybe. Oh, that's right. I finally forgot. Your pokey gear. Oh, she gives us the pokey gear. That's right. Oh, the pokey gear. They actually did a crazy update to it in this game. I definitely recommend it. If you haven't played GS Chronicles, I definitely recommend it. Uh, so it still has the telephone function whatever like never gonna use that but another cool thing is oh you don't actually start with it um another cool thing is that later you get an upgrade where it gives it the dex nav from the oras uh game where you can check what's in a route okay so because we don't have our pokeballs yet let me fact check here okay sweet yeah perfect okay so our nuzlocke does not begin until we get our pokeballs so we are good for a little while at least we have an attacking move. Interesting. So this could potentially be an encounter later on. Um, so if you look to the right of the layout, it should be up. We can only level up to level 15 before the first gym. If anything goes above that 15, we can't use it until the next gym or when it would be available. So I think like Bugsy, if I'm not mistaken, is 20. So we wouldn't be able to use a Pokemon that hit 16 until after Bugsy. Why am I going up here? We can't catch anything yet. Okay. So I will... I really want to try out Surging Strikes because that's... A, oh, right. So another cool thing is because of how time stuff goes in this game, we can actually just pick as many berries as we want. So I may, like, speed up so at some point. Oh, we only have five, though. That looks so cool. Wait, why did we only get one? 
Wait. So it's always a crit, but we only get one? That's... Okay. I mean, like... That's not terrible. Is it up to three in this game? Did I, did I misread? Strikes three consecutive times. It's always results. So the move might be glitched in this game. Um... Okay, so yes, so for instance here, the berries won't stop going, so we can just... Never mind, it's only on my handheld version that I can keep picking berries. Okay, good to know. We can't get... We can technically get infinite berries, but... Uh, let's just go ahead and speed up through this. We don't... We don't need all this talk. Map card. There we go. So now we have our map cards, and now we have a map. I think we can get... I'm trying to remember. We might be able to get, like, an old rod here. Maybe not. Neither of these guys have it. For some reason, I was thinking we could get uh, one of the rods and get an encounter here in Cherry Grove. But we have a few encounters. We can, I can think of at least four potential encounters. Oh, if I'm not mistaken, we also start with, like, a lot of money, too. Yeah, we start with ten grand, which is sweet. So let's go ahead and heal up since Surging Strikes isn't quite working like it's supposed to. Um, I don't think, okay, does the, oh, I know we can eventually wonder trade too, which is pretty cool. I think this is like a move forget, yeah, this is a move deleter, which is pretty sick. And then this is a move reminder. Yes. So they added those into the game as well, just as in uh, every pokey uh, Pokemon center. So that's a really awesome buff that they added there. Buff, whatever you want to call it. Quality of life feature, I guess. So we gotta go get the egg from... That wouldn't be a bad encounter. I didn't think Gen 8 Mons were in this. Uh, one, A couple things um, about the game. Since it's... Uh, since it's still relatively new, like I think it showed it one of the most recent... Oh, it is hard. Okay, so yeah, all the moves are randomized. Um, yeah, since it's still new, some of the uh, like visual things, like the XP there, and I think sometimes the HP may not show appropriately. So we'll just like make sure our levels are okay and stuff before like we go in anywhere. But we should be good. Hopefully, because we picked Giratina, thank you for voting, everybody who voted. Make sure you comment down below and make sweet, sensual love to that like and subscribe button if you haven't. Uh, hopefully, since we picked Giratina, I think that means that our rival will have the Cricketot. If that sets berries, I think he gives us some berries. Sweet. So he gives us Orin, and you give us nothing. But you, Cherry Berries, sweet. So we're just going to stock up on, like, an insane amount of berries. Gallade would be pretty sick, too. Yeah, I thought there were only Pokemon through Gen... Well, this is a Gen 4 mon, so I guess that's incorrect. I'm pretty sad Surging Strikes is, is nerfed or just programmed incorrectly in this game, though. That would be a, a really good, uh... Really good move. I mean, like, an always critting... Is this a Legendary? <laughs> Not at all. Dude, Denny's in it too. I love these sprites. These look really good. Techno Blast? We literally can't KO this. We have to run. Um, so... Okay, so items aren't randomized. That's good. I, I assume that's always an antidote. That feels like a antidote type like location. So what I'm running back for is because that... um. Because Surging Strikes only has 5 PP and our other move is Heal Pulse, we straight just can't do anything <laughs> if, uh... It's a Metal Claw. That's really sick. Oh! Did it just say... I'm gonna check just after we heal up here real quick, but that is a crazy move if we just got Arm Thrust. It is Arm Thrust. So multi-hitting moves... Hopefully Arm Thrust will actually do a multi-hit move that'd be pretty cool all right okay so that's that's not a bad move to get um we have some pretty good coverage right now between those two moves so we'll at least have something um i'm just gonna run six is probably fine to take on the rival 
with our with our move sets, and and we won't have balls yet anyway. So even if we lose to the rival, it's not the biggest biggest issue. Depending on what he has, if he has rich, actually no, if ridge ice, if he does have ridge ice, it's a uh, it should just have um, explosion. So, and Giratina's Ghost, so we should actually be good if that were the case. Yeah, it's just... Okay, I'm Thrust Sweets. I'll probably try and hit 7 before we take on the rival. And we get Pecha Berries. That's pretty cool. What up, Mr. Pokemon? Hello, hello, you must be bagels. Professor Elm said you would come. Please wait a bit. This is what I want Professor Elm to examine. These are rare stone. Oh, stones. Shiny stones inside. Oh! They're Mega Evolution stones. I guess I didn't pay attention to that on my uh, beginning first playthrough. He heals our Pokemon too, that's kind of cool. What up, Mr. Oak? I'm Professor Oak, a researcher. What do you give us? A rare Pokemon, indeed! Professor Ohm gave me the devil. Yes, I would love to help you out. Alright, he just gives us a Pokedex. I think it's set up like the Fire Red, Leaf Green uh, Pokedex as well, since it's a Fire Red uh, ROM hack. And he's going to the radio station. Do you give us anything else? Nope. Yeah, and then we have the rush back. Let's check it out. Yeah, it is the Fire Red, Leaf Green... I wonder, actually, where, what would it be under? Water's Edge? I doubt it. I'm just going to go to Numerical. Let's see if we can find Giratina and see if, if it tells us where they are in the wild. Oh my goodness. Can it, wait, was that it? That was Roserade. It should be around here. Glade, Fourth. It's high 400s, I think. Okay. Oh, it's just the last one. Next data. Area unknown. Oh, it tells us our its stat breakdown, too, and its ability? That's a really cool quality of life feature. We're going to be so bulky. Uh, okay, so our attack and special attack are actually the same. For some reason, I thought our special attack was... um Not significantly, but uh, a bit higher. So that's not so bad. So we should probably try and get one more level. And then... um. And then we can take on the rival. I think that would be fine. Flame wheel. I wonder if all the glades and uh is that a sketch? Okay, so everyone probably has like different moves too. Maybe not different abilities. But dip oh wait, no. Never mind. Cause that okay, seven's probably satisfactory to take on the rival. We also don't want to get too high in level that we can't use Giratina in the first gym. So let's go ahead and heal real quick. Oops. Alright. I don't think there's anything else we can get. We're still holding the Orin Berry. Yes, we are. Uh, yeah. We don't have Pokeballs, so I mean, like, worst case scenario, we lose to something crazy that the rival has. But we have pretty sick moves. And a good typing. Ghost Dragon isn't, like, isn't stellar. I think we have, like, four weaknesses. Oh, no fairies in this game. We might have five. Okay. That's still okay, though. Passer Boy. <laughs> yeah. <gasps> this is... This is revenge for the Cricketot gang. Yo! It has download, though. That's pretty cool. But I think it's not going to have anything. Uh, let's, let's Surging Strikes and Scout and see what it has. Oh Alright! Oh my god! Well, it's a good thing Dragon Rage Claws is in effect until the second gym. One thing with a Nuzlocke is, uh, not only do we not have the balls, so we don't, so we don't wipe. Wait, can we not, can we not proceed? We, um, So you can't lose that first battle. <laughs> uh, 
uh, cue the Jojo Oh No sound effect. Make sure I put that in. So we gotta grind before the, um... Tail Glow? That's insane. So we're probably gonna have to hit... Of probably 10? Oh, god dang it. Yeah, we're probably gonna have to hit, like, level 10 before, uh... Before we can beat the rival, because we gotta get above 40 health. No, that's actually not true. We're gonna gain a lot of health off this next level. We can probably fight him after, uh... After... I'm not even gonna fight this one. Yeah. But that's insane. I can't believe he actually had Dragon Rage. <laughs> like, the one move that he could have had to, uh... To possibly beat us. That's insane. Oh, one more. Um, I'm gonna go back and heal. Get the PP back. We're gonna have to find some PP ups, because that's gonna be a really difficult, uh... Move set to try and win since Surging Strikes is glitched. 42? Um, we can probably beat him now. I'm gonna heal up. Maybe. Alright, sorry about the speed up there. I just didn't think that the... The rival was gonna be such a problem. He's just, he's just blocking my way. He's like, don't go talk to the police. You, I won't let you. I can't believe it actually had Dragon Rage. We actually would have swept for a while with Krikatot, unironically. If it had, if it actually had Dragon Rage for us. Um, yeah, arm thrusts. Oh, also, if you look down here, I'll kind of like use my mouse. You'll see like it shows that the moves would be effective or not, or if you have stab. Which is pretty cool little feature there. So we'll surging strikes. Okay, yeah, we'll be fine because then we'll live the dragon rage with two HP. So we just needed to. I mean, we didn't need to do that, but it's okay. Yeah, if surging strikes work correctly. Or if uh, give it back. That's my trainer card. Ah, oh, dang! You saw my name. Ah, oh, dang it. Heal up our, our poor boy. <laughs> Alright. We should be good now. That was just a... Super unfortunate... I guess, dragon rage. Yeah, they're, they're... Yeah, they're not ready, I guess. <laughs> uh, do we go this way? I think we can go this way. Yeah, this is fine. Alright. What up, Professor Elm? I just got beat by a Krikatot. Who are you? We're investigating the case of the missing Pokemon here. Rule number one, whoever did it will come back to the site. Oh my, you must be the one who did it. Stop there! Bagels has nothing to do with it. It was a red-haired boy looking into the building. And I battled him. Oh man, what do we name our rival? Alright, let me go ahead. You know what, no. He wanted the Krikatot, he positioned, he started the Krikatot gang. This is Beavit. We're gonna name it Beave. Arrival. Dude. Oh, actually, you know what? Well, we can do Beavit. Uh, there we go. Beavit. Make sure to check out Beavit to leave it on Twitch. Chat. Uh, link down in the description. All right. So that was rough. Pokemon what was the reason. I wonder if he keeps that now for the uh, duration of the game. That'd be pretty cool. Do you, what do you want me to do? Oh, I gotta give you the rocks. Stone. <sighs> that was. It's a good thing we didn't have our Pokeballs. Oh, that's so crazy. Okay, so one thing. So like I was bringing up earlier. So if a random Pokemon in the wild has Dragon Rage until the second gym, we are invoking that kind of like. Uh, it's called the Dragon Rage Clause, where if we faint to Dragon Rage, it, because most Pokemon, unless they have 150 base stat, don't have over 40 health, um, we're gonna not just outright lose to that, because that's just unfair. But as of right now, we got our Pokeballs, the Nuzlocke has begun. So we'll probably get an encounter or two. Uh, go ahead and tell me down below as well if you want to see these be longer episodes or if we'd rather keep them kind of short. I don't think we have the talk to mom again, but let's go ahead and do it anyway, just in case. Nope, she has nothing for us. She does not save our money or do anything. I don't think there's anything else in town for us to get, so I guess... Oh no. 
We battle him. This is scary. Depending on what he has, we could wipe here, potentially. I forgot we battle him. <laughs> okay. Okay. We need him to not have any... He has trout. He has trout for our, for our surging strikes. Okay, he has tackle. Okay. We're okay. Oh my god. This is bad. Oh, this sunlight fa I messed up. Okay, I think we can- I can't believe he has a Cernius. We can do this. I'm just- Oh my god. Oh my god. This is scary. This is gonna be a difficult run. Well, thanks. Good, yeah, good battle, Ethan. I didn't think you'd start with Xerneas. You people wanted me to pick Cricketot. You're, you're monsters. You're monsters. Oh, right. We also get the EXP all um, at the beginning of the game, which is pretty cool. And we so it uh, has Gen Eight level up mechanics, so we get the um, get XP from like catching and stuff too. But we can turn it off at any point. Okay, uh, we need to get back our power points, our PP back up. Let's go ahead and use it for now. All members of your team will accumulate some points. Uh, he doesn't heal us, that's right. Alright, let's get our first encounter. I have my doc pulled up here for encounters, which, by the way, if you don't know, um, how we nickname Pokemon on the channel is uh, if you're subscribed or you comment, you say something funny down below and I read it and I think about it the next day, or if I have it pulled up here, I write them down throughout the day. Uh, at work, I work a lot, so I <laughs> have stuff just written down. Um, we name the encounters after like subscribers and people who comment. So make sure you make sweet sensual love to that like and subscribe button and comment as well, like answering the question of the day. And our first... Solosis at level 2. Alright, we could potentially arm thrust this, but I think we're better off going for the Pokeball. It is, uh... Not a strong Pokemon. Uh, Ranunculus is really strong. Well, we got it on the first try. Good enough for me. I am perfectly fine with with a Solosis, especially depending on what it has. You know, I actually have the perfect name for this. Um, I th yeah, here it is. It was Cyborg. I thought that was such a cool name. I think he I think he used to comment on the videos when we used to do content more often back in the day. But uh, thank you for being a subscriber. And voting for Giratina. Cyborg. Alright. We didn't really use any PP, just the ball straight out. So let's let's check out Cyborg. Brave, not a great nature. Storm Drain. That's not bad though. Terrible EVs. Like or IVs rather. <laughs> it has bone rush though, that's kinda cool. Um to take advantage of that whopping six at boosted attack. Okay. Not a not a great start, but it's it's coverage. I I probably would have preferred the time pole if I'm gonna be honest. In retrospect. Uh let's go ahead and arm thrust. What? It has stamina, that's so What the hell is Behemoth back? Oh, that's the uh that's, a uh, the move of, um, Zamazenta. Okay, that's a pretty cool, pretty cool little Mon. I'm afraid, if, if it was at level 4, or even 3, I'd probably have time pull up. But being at level 2 is that, well, we, there's no way we could have we caught that. Drought Xerneas is actually insane, though. That would have been quite an encounter, but at least we know that Xerneas... Yeah, I'm not fighting this. <laughs> I'm not fighting it again. Um, 
that we at least we know Xerneas is in the game and can be caught. I'm actually going to go take our 10 grand that we have and buy Pokeballs. Since we can't buy, uh, since we can't heal in battle anyway, I went to the wrong place. Um, I think it's going to make more sense to just invest most of our money in Pokeballs. Yeah, you just do that. Okay, I don't think we can faint due to poison either, so I'm not too worried about like antidotes and paralyzed heals. Repels might be worth it once we start getting a little bit higher level. I'll probably buy like three. Yeah, that's fine. We're, we're at 10 grand. That's that's satisfactory. We're doing a randomizer, though, so we could run into crazy stuff. Um, I'm going to buy 30 and leave us with 3 grand since we can't use potions. Okay, and we do get 3 Premier Balls. So I'll save that. Let's go get uh, 2 more encounters. We'll probably get our 2 more encounters and then wrap up the episode. We'll see, we'll see how I'm feeling, because I think we're nearing a half hour at this point. I forgot to set a timer. So we'll kind of, like, gauge that. I don't predict anything really one-shotting us except a, uh, another, uh, <laughs> Krikatot. So I think we're pretty fine, barring a uh, Krikatot encounter. So let's see what our Route 46 encounter is. Yo, I'm not even mad about that at all. Uh, it'll crit. Unnerve. I'm not mad about that either. Let's hit it with the surging strikes. I don't think it'll. I don't think it'll die to this. Yeah, not at all. Techno blast. That's so sick. We'll hit it with another one. I think we're definitely gonna have to get it a little bit lower. Behemoth bash and techno blast. That looks really cool. Okay, that wasn't a ton of damage. We'll hit it with another Surging Strikes and then try and throw a ball. I forgot to use... Oh, it wouldn't matter if we had a Barry. It actually has a Nerve. Oh, that's going to be huge for gems. I'll hit it with one more since we know they crit anyway. Um, So we know what the crit damage is. We just can't hit it with... Ring Out? This Empoleon's busted. I'm going for Mirror Ball. Yo, if we catch this, this would be huge. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's okay. If we got if we got a sack, uh, if we got a sack cyborg, we got a sack cyborg. I'm sorry, dude. Um, I don't think we're gonna be able to catch this thing. Oh my god, it knows to go for that now. I think I can take a crit. There's no way Arm Thrust doesn't KO. Okay, let's, um... Because we can't heal. We probably should have leveled up Cyborg first. We might have to forfeit our... Our Pog freaking... Encounter thing. It's doing a lot of damage to Darkstone. And we can't lose him, otherwise we're wiping... This is a tough call. I really don't want to lose this. Technoblast is going to do a ton of damage. It knows Ring Out. That will do a ton of damage. Both those things will probably KO Cyborg, honestly. We can't... Even if we had a berry, it wouldn't have mattered. Do we throw one more ball? I think we have to sack the Empoleon counter, unfortunately. Or bank on really low arm thrust hits. It's still early. We're going to get more encounters. I don't think we can risk losing Darkstone. Yeah. Yeah, we can't We can't risk losing Darkstone this early. Let me hit level 6 off that. That really sucks. I So we can use healing items outside of battle. So, so we don't run into like a Shadow Tag Bond. Let's go ahead and do that. Um, did I say Overdrive? What move is... Is that... Uh, what's its name? Toxic toxicity. It is. Okay, so that's actually really good. 17. Okay. So that's not a bad. And we have oh, if he had water moves, this potentially would have been fine. It really sucks losing that encounter. Okay, I take it back. I am gonna buy a couple um potions just for like walk back. Well we bought repels, I guess that works too. But let's definitely heal up first. 
Uh, we'll buy a couple more Pokeballs and a couple potions. Let's call it 10, get the Premier Ball, and we'll call it like 3. So we know in the next route we can catch Glade. Glade's probably the best. Yeah, Glade's probably the best. We can get one more encounter. 30, I think, will be our last one for this episode. Yeah, I think we just about hit the half hour mark. We didn't have this before. I'm not mad about heat more. It's kind of cool. Uh, level 2 kind of sucks. But it's fine. We can swap to Cyborg here. Because Cyborg's really bulky too. I don't know what level... Oh my god. Um. Guillotine's normal, so I'm gonna swap the Darkstone. Technoblast? Why does everything have Technoblast? Uh, I'm gonna go for the Pokeball. Because I don't think we can actually hit this thing. It's level 2, so maybe. Okay, perfect. Sweets. So that's another encounter. Heatmore. Heatmore's a really cool Pokemon. Um, I think was it what game was it? Was it our Uranium Nuzlocke that we had a Heatmore that was really, really good? I think it was. Uh I'm gonna name Heatmore after Stormwick. Stormwick's always been a big supporter on the channel. Don't forget, if you weren't listening earlier, just skip to this point to the video in the video. Uh, we nickname our mods after subscribers and people who comment, so make sure you do that. Stormwick. Perfect. Uh, let's check out our, our new Stormwick. Gentle. Bad. Really decent Ivies, though. Portal Power. Weakens non-contact moves. I've never heard of that ability. That is a insane moveset, though. I can't play Guillotine in U-turn. This is a... This is... This Stormwick is actually... Gonna be, like... Insane. We need to definitely level it up. Um, you know what? We'll, we'll do a couple battles and then we'll probably wrap up the episode. Let's, let's try and clear this out. I want to have a bit longer one for the first episode. Uh, I was hoping to get Stormwick to at least four. It's fine. We'll do one more. Okay, Stormwick to four. Aurora's w with Electric Surge. Yeah, so we'll battle Youngster Joey, see if we wipe, and then go from there. You look weak! Come on, let's battle! Battle, 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 battle. Venonat. There are Venonats in this area, actually. That's kind of cool. I can't believe we have to be wary of random moves, like Technoblast. Actually, we don't because Darkstone is the... Uh, Ghost. Is this, I forgot to heal. Let's go for the surging strikes. Ah. That's a two-hit KO. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. Surging strikes. We're we're gonna resist that. And Venonat's attack is that was a crit crit for one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm probably gonna have to swap up. Um, and turn off the EXP all. Once we hit like 10 or 11, because we still have to do Sprout Tower. And Darkstone's about to hit 10. Oh, uh, let's do another one. So do they actually have Mons that are like in the area? That's kind of cool. Why does it resist this? Or, or wait, or does that mean it's super effective? No, it's Fairy. Oh, because it's like, it's like a Fairy, right? I forget. Okay, we're going to swap. Oh, I have to turn off Shift. Or turn on a uh, turn on set. I, I've been kind of cheating. I haven't actually cheated yet, um, but we can't. We have to turn on set because we can't. Uh, uh, I'll, I'll show after this. I'll swap after we swap here. We haven't cheated yet, but we're kind of cheating in the future, potentially on accident. Sketch. Okay, so it failed the sketch. So we'll go for Bone Rush. Does it know our moves? Really? What a meme. Alright. What is... Oh, Breaking Swipe. That's a really cool... Really cool little moveset. 
Pass on my yellow overdrive. If you don't love JoJo, I'm sorry. You should. Dude, Cyborg hitting eight. Sick. Okay, I'll, I'll show what I mean here. Um, see, it says like it right here, it's about to use the Dene. Uh, since we have Switch on, we can hit yes, but we're supposed to have it not have be able to ask us. We're supposed to be playing on set, so I'll hit no here and then change it after this. This is the first battle with more than one Pokemon, so I just, uh, I just missed that. Oh no. That's a 120 base power move. It's level 3. We have a lot of levels. Cyborg is bulky. Okay, we're good. Bop. Just one? Oh, okay. I was about to say, I thought it was at least two. Are we dead to crit? We might be dead to crit. I'll swap here. I'm fine with swapping. We can finish it with Karate Chops. Predicting the Techno Blast. Yeah, there we go. That's fine. Why does literally everything like has Techno Blast? Also, we didn't put on berries. I am... I am... This is a different kind of, This is my first hardcore Nuzlocke on the channel, so I'm all kinds of all over the place right now. So we're gonna hit 10 on Darkstone, which is sick. Look at those stat gains. It's, <laughs> that's a choice. That that transform is a choice. <laughs> I feel it. Okay. So Darkstone gets transform. Interesting. And has contrary. That's gonna be really useful. So we're gonna do a couple things here real quick. I'll probably um make it so we get more berries in the game like kind of try and like farm some berries because i definitely think we're gonna need them um so we use this real quick cherry petch it or there we go okay we have four right now so we can give everybody one and then we'll uh lost my train of thought there i'll probably i'll probably put more in the game just to get the orange berries because orange berries aren't like anything. It's just because we can't use held items and we can farm them. It just takes time. So I'll probably put those in the game, but I won't like cheat on anything else. But thank you guys so much for tuning in today's video. It's about a 40. It looks like we're about 40 minutes in. So that's a pretty good start. This is taking a long time to save. That's okay. We're good. Okay. Perfect. I got a little worried there for a second. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Them. If you enjoyed, kiss that like and subscribe button. Give it a big old smooch for me. I would super appreciate it. You guys are great. I'm so glad to be back. I hope you guys are enjoying. Sorry, Cricket Talk gang, but at least you did get to show your power on the rival's team. If we had really any other Pokemon, we probably would have had to overlevel in order to overcome it. Luckily, our we didn't get any Pokeballs before the rival, or well, otherwise we would have had to wipe. But that was awesome.